Today, I'll be cooking the most expensive and at the same time, the cheapest food in Nigeria. I know you're guessing which food is the most expensive and which food is the, the cheapest in Nigeria. Well, wait until the end of this video. I am going to see the food that has been saving life for millions of years ago up till today. Welcome to my cooking channel like father like son and your local chef Vine Nogu. So today I said I'll be cooking the most expensive food and also the most affordable food in Nigeria. But the interesting thing, I'll be cooking it without fire! Ladies and gentlemen, the food I'm talking about is... Gari! Yeah, Gari is a popular Nigerian delicacy. You can make it like a swallow, you can make it and drink, you can chew it like that. And it's made from cassava that has been processed. So, but gari is very important because it falls under all classes of food in Nigeria. I mean, when I mean class, the high class, middle class, lower class, and in terms of income that people earn. So, every class of people eat this gari in one way or the other. So, today I'm going to be making the commonest type of gari that everybody in Nigeria at least have tasted before, which is drinking gari. I know some of you have seen a video before when they said, one of our former president was drinking gari. You know, that was President Tolisha Gwabasanjo was drinking gari, you know. So today I'm going to show you the best way you can drink your gari and you will enjoy it. First of all, what do we need for this our special delicacy? Some people call it the number one first aid in Nigeria. Some people call it Ozi Bondu. That's it saves the life of the Igbos. <laughs> Also, also the one he saves life in Nigeria. You know, there have, there have been different names that people call it. Some people call it Gerium, Gerium oxide. You know, these are guy names. I remember in secondary school we gave it different names. Some call it Garrison. Some call it Coke. You know, it all depends. But general name for it is Gary, and you can drink it. You can use it to eat other food we have like all the soups we have you can use gari when you make it into a swallowable form you can use it to eat all the soups you have in nigeria also you can use it for other for other types of food too but when you want to take it through some chew it with granite some drink it with granite coconut you know with beans and so on but today i'm going to show you the simplest thing we need so the things we need is the gari one Two, cold water. Three, granite. Four, fresh milk. You know, you could use powder milk or liquid milk, but milk. And we we'll need a bowl to put everything. That's it, that's it.
Okay, I hope you enjoyed this video and if you love what you've seen, share this video, click like and also comment. I also want to beg each and every one of you to subscribe to this channel and like. Our challenge is to get to the 1000 mark. Please help me get to that 1000 mark. I appreciate everybody that has been that has subscribed in one way or the other. I appreciate everybody that has been following up on this channel. I appreciate everybody that has been watching our contents in one way or the other. Shout out to all of you. Next week, I'll be bringing another interesting video and I hope you also love it. See you some other time. I'm still your local chef, Vine Inogo.